Good morning, everyone. Well, I guess it's not really morning anymore because it's literally almost 11 o'clock, but it's a Wednesday and today we are seeing if Wednesdays still suck. I mean, the last Tuesday I just did was actually really good, averaged at about $24 an hour. So I'm trying to see if Wednesdays still suck. So I'm walking down to my car right now. I'm trying to get started by 11 o'clock, but first you guys know what I gotta do. I don't even need to say Oh yeah, that's good. That's good. Decided to go with the Body Armor Edge today. I'm trying to stay away from carbonation for a little while. It's just not the best for you, so Body Armor Edge it was. And it's now 11.04, so let's go ahead and start the dash, see how much money we can make. We've got our first order from Little Caesars. It's $8, 8 miles, not the best. But we are still trying to maintain that priority status to see if this new DoorDash Rewards is actually worth it and can help me overcome one of the suckiest days, Wednesday, and I can still make some good money. So let's go drop this order off. Hi, just had a DoorDash for Catherine. Just picked up that next order and what do you know, it's one of those high payout orders. So it looks like being a priority dasher is already paying off today. It's a $10.50 plus order. So that means it's gonna be more, it's only 5.6 miles. I don't know what it is about that new plus thing that they're doing, but I just love it. Because I know the order is already good. I don't have to guess if it's a hidden tip order. And I'm like, well, how high can it go? I've literally had one that was like 1050 plus and it ended up being like $22, I think it was, yesterday or something like that. So it can get up pretty high. I'm like, okay, how high is this order gonna be? Is it gonna be $20? Is it gonna be $11? I don't know. It's like a dopamine rush. It's insane. No way. No way, guys. Check out this total I got. Over $21. $21 for that order. That's what I call priority. Now we got a stack order to Chipotle. Let's go get it done. Guys, this is just absurd. I mean, I just made $40 in my first hour on a Wednesday. This is just crazy. We did four orders. Two of them were those high payout orders. And now we got this one to Mod Pizza. It's really not the best order, but I want to again maintain that high acceptance rate so i stay in the priority range and what's crazy too is that i'm not even in the top tier priority right now because my acceptance rate is only at 62 percent and i'm still getting this many priority orders so it's just crazy we we're making such good money let's keep going thanks for choosing thought i'll be with you in just one moment okay i actually just had a doordash pickup for ashley give me one moment please okay no problem i'm sorry all right so sorry about that. I was taking someone else's order. What's the name you said? Uh, for Ashley. Ashley C? Yeah. Okay, go ahead and pull up to the window. Thanks. I just had a DoorDash uh, for Ali and Diana. Three. So you got two? Yeah. So in total for that lunch shift, I ended up making $72 in just 2.66 hours, which is an hourly pay of $27 an hour. So yes, things did slow down after that $40 first hour we had, but still $27 an hour on a Wednesday lunch shift. That's crazy good. But now I'm taking my break and then I gotta take my dog to the vet. He's doing fine. For those of you who want an update, he has not had a seizure since we've taken him and gotten him on his medicine. So it's been like three months now, he's doing great. We're just taking him in for a checkup. So speaking of taking my dog to the vet, that is an unexpected expense that can come up at random times. Like I had happen a couple months ago where my dog had six seizures in one day and I had to take him to the emergency room and pay thousands of dollars that I just barely had. It was a huge chunk of me and my wife's savings. And if we 
we hadn't had that saved up, we wouldn't have been able to pay for it. But that's where the sponsor of this video, Ivy, comes in. They help you in situations like that, especially when it comes to gig workers because they work directly with gig workers like DoorDash drivers, Uber Eats drivers, and any other gig app you can think of. So when you're in a bind like I was, you can get a cash advance super quick and super easy. All you have to do is put in your information and they will send money directly onto your phone that day. It's that simple. And the more apps that you deliver for and put into Ivy, the higher advance you're going to have. So make sure when you do sign up for them, you put in every single app that you're working for. So if you're in a pinch and you need a quick hundred bucks, make sure you head over to Ivy and use my link that I have for you down in the description. And the first 100 people that use it get free cash advances for life. That means that you don't have to pay any fees on those cash advances for life, the first 100 people. So again, click that link in the description and let's get going with the dinner shift. So unfortunately, I've literally been sitting here waiting for my DoorDash app to work because it just won't. For some reason, DoorDash just won't work right now, which literally is why I just talked about Ivy Card because stuff like this happens all the time. Like it's literally happening to me right now. So I'm trying to get my app back up working. I don't know, it's some glitch, some shortage, some outage. I don't know what's going on, but yeah. It, it's kind of rough. I, I don't know if I'll be able to go back out and dash tonight, but we'll see what happens. Finally, I got it to work. It's now seven o'clock though. I've been sitting here for quite a while trying to get my app to work. And finally, seven o'clock, it works. I got this for my first order back, Marco's Pizza. We lost a lot of time, probably only gonna be able to go for about two hours now. But anyways, let's get going. Just had a DoorDash for Alexis. They can't find the order, so looks like DoorDash is still having quite a bit of problems or something because apparently this order doesn't exist in their system. Yep, had to unassign that because for some reason everything's just not going my way right now. Well, my next order is not giving me much hope. It's this one to Marco's Pizza. <laughs> Same Marco's Pizza that literally didn't have my order 10 seconds ago when I left the parking lot. And if this is the exact same order, I'm going to be so mad. In fact, let me check on that real quick. Oh good, it's not the same person, so that's good. Maybe they have this one ready. I probably should have just declined it, but I mean, the payout's just too good for the mileage. The, the drop-off location is right in a busy area where I want to be dashing. And I don't know, we'll see what happens, I guess. Just had a DoorDash for Alex. Alex? Yeah. Okay. Um, okay. Um, six, 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 okay. So I'm going to have to make one. Okay. We don't got one. Ten minutes? Okay. Thank you. Well, ten minute wait on this one, guys. We're just going to stick it out. Look at that, guys. Forty minutes, and I've only completed one order. That is not so good, $9.50 in 40 minutes. But we do have our next order. It's another good one, Little Caesars, $6, three miles. Let's go get it done. We got a lot of ground to make up to get our hourly average up. Okay, what is going on right now? I show up two minutes before the pickup time, two minutes before the pickup time. And I go in and he said, I just put in that order. It's gonna be about an eight to 10 minute wait. So I'm just chilling in my car again. I guess this is how this Wednesday night is going to go. We got DoorDash glitch, we got super high wait times, we got slow restaurants, we got it all going on right now. And I guess we'll just see how this night turns out. Yeah, so that wait ended up being 20 minutes and I just decided I'm calling it a day. I mean, that was just basically unbearable. It was so bad. I mean, I literally made $15 in an hour and 20 minutes. That's how bad it was, guys. Like, I just couldn't do it anymore. So, call it a day. So, even with all that garbage that went on today, I was still able to make $87 in four hours of work, which is about $22 an hour, which is actually pretty good for a Wednesday. So, imagine if 
I hadn't made that $15 in an hour and 20 minutes and had made a regular amount of money. We would have done even better. So I'm surprised at how good we did. That Priority Dasher definitely helped because we had that $41 hour earlier today. So I do think it does come in handy. I mean, $22 on Wednesday, one of the slowest days of the week, that's still doable. And we could have made even more had all that garbage not happened. But anyways, there you guys have it. Hopefully you enjoyed this video. I'll be doing another test tomorrow with this same thing. I just want to extend it and do some more hours to make this test have more validity to it. But yeah, if you enjoyed it, make sure you subscribe, make sure you stay tuned for tomorrow and I'll see you guys then.